Lorraine and Ricky, Deacon Blue. Great to see you here at Our Heroes 2014 and huge congratulations as well for winning Our Entertaining Hero. Thank you so much. Very honoured. Absolutely. What does it mean to you and what will you be doing with the award? Well, the, the award will be going on our, uh, I think, in our studio wall where we have a few other things that will be going up there. And it's just, it's really humbling actually to, to sit here all night and see these real heroes walk on that stage and tell their stories. You know, and I've been in tears and I've been laughing and I've had a brilliant night and then, you know, to cap it all, to actually go up there and receive an award ourselves is brilliant. So we're very grateful. Now, what else are you up to at the moment? Well, we've just finished a new album, funnily yeah. enough, and uh, it'll be coming out in September. So we're starting to do some um, gigs, some festivals in the summer, and then we're going on tour again after the album's out in the autumn and the winter. And I'm doing a play, and Ricky's doing his usual stuff. Whatever that <laughs> is, he doesn't really tell me what that is. That's nice, that's cool. That's good. Too much, that. too much. For yeah, no, we do loads of things. Do loads lots of things. But the, the record is the main thing, um, comes out in September. It's called a new house single, first single. I think will be called a new house, and uh, we're just getting all the stuff together for that. A literally, new house. A, a new, new house. house, a new house. Yeah. Do you have a new house? No, no, but it reflects We've back had to one. yeah, but it goes back to our kind of experience of the sixties and. Uh, in my case, probably <laughs> before that, but just the excitement of when moving out into new things, and it's uh, it's, a, it's an album about nature. It's a lot of album about Scotland, about the kind of me actually going off on tour last year and finding how wonderful it was, a beautiful place it was. So uh, there's a lot to talk about that. It's a very optimistic yeah. record. That sounds great. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, there's been a lot of smiles and faces tonight, mm -hmm. not just because of all the amazing people here and all the prizes. But Clyde's roaming about from the Commonwealth Games. Yeah. Yes. I, I believe you had a little meeting. We did. Yeah, we He's did. a very handsome young man. Exchange phone numbers. He's very <laughs> handsome. And that was with the, the mask on and <laughs> the mask off. Now, I've seen both. Are you just saying that so that you can get tickets to the Commonwealth <laughs> yeah. Games? Well, I actually applied for more tickets today, believe uh -huh, it They've released yeah, more, yeah. I believe. So, so I still haven't got tickets, but uh, I'm, not, I'm hoping we get some. I'm going with Clyde, though. But yeah, well, there we go. You're That's not, not for discussion. Now, what, what sports would you like to go and see? What have you been trying oh, to, to be do? To be honest with you, I was a bit, when I first put the first application in, I only put on the glamorous ones, and I thought, I, I really want to go see judo, but now I kind of want to go and see anything. Go see anything, really? uh, And I want, especially because my son, I think it's such a great experience. I think you'll remember it for the rest of your life. But I think it'll just be great being in Glasgow and it all going on. I think yeah. that's just brilliant. You know? Have you been asked to do the opening ceremony? I've actually asked to run 100 metres, but I just felt <laughs> that, uh, you know, I'm going to leave it for one or two younger folks. So. That was good deflection. <laughs> okay, we might see you at the opening ceremony yet. Fingers crossed. Who knows? <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much.